odds to finish that exam? Right, you're talking about 17-year-old John Macharia, who is disabled and doesn't have hands. He has battle illness, disability, and poverty, but he's optimistic that he is going to become either a doctor or a computer engineer. At an area called Kiharu in Muranga County, we catch up with a candidate sitting the KCSE exams at Wilaya Academy. Being one of the thousands sitting the exams, 17-year-old John Masharia is a special candidate. A disabled boy with no hands, it has not been an easy journey getting to this defining moment. <laughs> John has a special seat and writing surface which enables him to write with his legs, an art he has marvelously developed. He is asthmatic, a condition that has troubled him, making him an on and off student. So when I zaka hat, pata hat attack, come and cook a barabara. I see I'm side busy. So I I have to sit there. But can I go jump side busy? Four months, he's average. Uh, just because of the 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 problem, he can do better. But because of the health problem, he has been in and out. But he has been trying his best. John comes from a humble background, but back at home, we find his very proud father. Johnny mutoto mwenye biti. Johnny Kurima, Kupanda, Kupalidia, you are the John Natafania. Now you are to Miguyake. But John is not the kind to despair. Despite the adversities, he is a positive minded boy and has big dreams for the future. Get a Kusomeo Dakari Sana Sana, get a Kusomeo computerist, Namgu, Manak and Yomungu and Balkia. And I'm happy for him because he plays around with the other people's football. He likes football very much and he does it. A few weeks ago, stakeholders including the Ministry of Education and the Kenya Institute of Curriculum Development held a conference on which a plan to meet the special needs of disabled children while sitting exams was set rolling. This is meant to look into the needs such as longer time given to students such as John while undertaking exams. Sharon Momani, KTN. Well, I hope that particular program is set into pace really fast because I remember people who had special needs in my school right. got a longer period to sit for the exams. And also we must acknowledge the fighting spirit.